about to ride. I'm Kelly Slater. I found my perfect fins. Have you found your perfect setup yet? I have spent that time to go and look at, compare all the different fins. Each surfer is going to have obviously a different, different feel for what they like. You have, uh, you know, every aspect you want. You have, you have your speed and your drive, maneuverability, all that. But there will be certain fins and shapes that do different things. So you, you know, you just got to figure out which suits your surfing the best. You, know, you can go and go to go to a, a surf shop that has a testing center or whatever, and just go borrow fins and try out a few different fins. They have different flexes, different areas, you know, you can take note of how much area the fin has, how deep it is, compare them with the other fins. You just go try them in different conditions. I would uh, recommend to anyone to just basically go out and just just test it, you know, test it for yourself and um, try finding your perfect setup. The K2.1 fin I like because it turns really sharp. It turns in a real tight radius uh, uh, turns, and you know the board's loose because the back fin's smaller than the front fin's, and overall we don't have a, a ton of area in that fin uh, setup. So um, I like them in beach breaks, I like them in reef breaks, hollow waves, um, anywhere where you basically want to get somewhere real quick, do your thing, get out of there, and that's basically what they're good for. You know my fins were basically created for beach breaks. At that time we were surfing a lot of beach breaks on tour. But I just changed the, the shape a little bit, made it a little tiny bit more upright and had a little more tip in it. The K3 is more for a wave like Jeffrey's Bay, maybe a Rincon, somewhere where it's down the line has a big face on it and you draw your turns out a little bit more. In a big facey wave where you need to get around long sections, they're really good because they, they're a deep fin, kind of a, a pulled back foil shape as you can see. And um, that seems to maintain the speed better over a long uh, long turns. If it's a more open face, kind of need to draw your turnout sort of wave, I'll ride the K3, that fin template. And um, if I'm riding more of a hollow beach break, uh, either a hollow wave like a reef break, pipe, or chopu, or I'm surfing a beach break, I'll throw in the, the 2.1s. So that's basically what I switch back and forth from. That will cover pretty much every condition for me.